Naledi is a fantastic new species, uh, part of our family tree. Where it fits is something that's going to be the next phase of study. What we know about it is quite a lot right now. We know about it from 1,550 elements so far, although we have thousands left in the Dinaledi chamber where we discovered it. It's a tall primitive human ancestor, would have stood about five feet tall, a small brain about the size of a large orange, but a very human-like character to the overall plan of the skull. It's got small teeth, like yours, but primitive in their shape and form, which lets us know that it's somewhere in that transitional stage of an early human, an early member of our genus, but not quite to where we are yet. How it fits, that waits to be seen. But from here downward is where Naledi gets really strange. It's got an ape-like shoulder complex, an ape-like core or a primitive core within our lineage that something more like the most primitive hominins like Lucy or Mrs. Plez, right down to the pelvis. When you move down below though, and you go down below the leg, it has long legs, which culminate in this incredibly human-like foot, something that was a complete surprise. Because if you pop up back to the top and look at the arms, you see they become more and more human-like as you move away from that primitive shoulder until you reach the wrist, which is incredibly human-like, the palm, which is human-like. The whole plan of the hand is human-like, but the distal fingers are some of the most curved we've ever seen in the entire human ancestor record. So what we have overall is something we've never seen before. A creature out of the past that clearly gives us a signal to the origins of perhaps our species, but in a way we don't understand at this point.